storms later on tonight, and that signals a change with our weather. I'll have your forecast coming up next. And now your weather with Chief Meteorologist Cameron Moreland. It was another beautiful summer day across northeast Wisconsin with high temperatures mainly in the mid 80s. But some cooler weather is going to work in for this upcoming weekend. Here's a look at your seven day temperature trend. Upper 70s to lower 80s tomorrow and then only lower to mid 70s for Saturday and Sunday before some more heat and humidity returns for Monday and Tuesday. Upper 80s to lower 90s both days. Right now, away from Lake Michigan, temperatures are still in the 80s, including a reading of 85 degrees in Wapaka. In Green Bay, it is mostly sunny and 83. The dew point is sitting at a very comfortable 54 degrees. In Appleton, it's mostly sunny and 82. Lots of sunshine across the state today, but we've got a couple of fronts that are headed our way over the next 24 hours. And those fronts are going to bring a change to our weather and give us a chance for some showers and thunderstorms. Right now, we're looking at an area of thunderstorms developing across North and South Dakota down into Western Nebraska. We actually have a severe thunderstorm watch up for that cluster of storms. It's expected to increase in aerial coverage and intensity as it moves East Southeast throughout the night. But then eventually it's going to start to weaken as it makes its way into central Wisconsin tomorrow morning. There is a marginal risk of severe weather late tonight into tomorrow morning to the west of Lake Winnebago, which means a couple of storms could be on the strong side with some gusty winds, some heavy rain, and possibly some small hail. You can see those thunderstorms coming in on SkyCast at 6.15 a.m. tomorrow morning. They still will be packing a punch as far as heavy rain is concerned, but you can see what happens as they make their way towards the Fox Valley and Lakeshore. They will quickly start to fall apart. Maybe a lingering shower during the morning, and then we'll break into a lot of sunshine by tomorrow afternoon. High temperatures tomorrow will be a little bit cooler than what we saw today. Most of us will be in the upper 70s to lower 80s. We'll see lots of sunshine on Saturday behind the cold front with temperatures for the most part, in the lower to mid 70s, but there will be a range 60s near Lake Michigan, upper 70s across central Wisconsin. So tonight, look for that full strawberry moon. Overnight lows will be around 60. We'll see increasing clouds after midnight, a chance for some showers and thunderstorms tomorrow morning, then breaking back into sunshine by the afternoon. My three degree guarantee for tomorrow is 80. If I can hit that high within three degrees, we will donate $100 to Compassionate Home Health Care. And we did that today. I forecast 84. The actual high temperature was 84 degrees. On Saturday, sunny and 73. Sun and clouds on Sunday, 71. Hot and humid again on Monday, upper 80s to lower 90s. We'll see more of the same on Tuesday. And then late Tuesday into Wednesday, it looks like the remnants of either Hurricane Cristobal or Tropical Storm Cristobal will make its way across Wisconsin, followed by some cooler weather as we uh, wrap up next week and move into the following weekend. So beautiful summer-like weather. We'll turn a little bit cooler, but still stay beautiful over the weekend. Nina?